I am going to walk you through how to back up your iPad onto an external drive. From here, let's take a look at some things. So it's not standard that the files folder will be on your iPad. Um, and if this is very new to you, similar to your computer, your iPad also has internal storage. And this internal storage is labeled similarly with the word files or file, right? Um, when you download something, like if you download a photo from the internet onto your iPad, it will either save into your photos or it will save into a files folder for you on the iPad within a downloads folder in the files folder. <laughs> so now the files app is off of my home screen. I wanna show you how to put it on there. Um, so I'm gonna search for the word files. Here are some of the files and programs that I have on my iPad that I have downloaded or that came on the iPad. So easily enough, then down here in my recents, this is like your recent um, sort of dock down here at the bottom. I'm going to take this and drag it onto the home screen. So I'm gonna drag and drop and there it is. So for this, you're going to want um, some type of backup disc that we chatted about just now is compatible with your specific iPad. Um, I got this from Costco several years ago and I'm just now started using it for this purpose. I really like it. It is the Sand, Sun, or sorry, SanDisk SSD. Um, pretty good value for the money. So here we can see that um, it checks out and it connects to my iPad. So I'm gonna go ahead and just connect these pieces. All right, so now that the iPad is ready and we are ready from here, we are going to then plug in our backup desk. Now we're plugged in our backup drive in the iPad, but you can see normally on your computer, it would pop up as its own external drive to um, configure and work with. However, on the iPad, we don't really have that functionality. Uh, so in this case, I'm going to go into the files folder I handily dandily put here earlier. And now I can see it's here on the side, right? I went ahead and relabeled it. Uh, I recommend that you do the same. It's just good to stay organized that way, um, but whatever suits you best, okay? So here you can see I've actually already backed up a file. It takes some time. It takes some time to back up files. So just letting you know for future backing up being stuff. So you can see here, I backed this up today. Let's click it and just see what happens. Sorry. So it's importing it now into Procreate. And this is my Procreate file. And these are all of the things that I've drawn in this specific Procreate file, which is awesome. And now you can see that there are two of them. There are two files here. This is the original and this is the copy. I don't really need two copies right now, so I'm going to select and delete the duplicate. And now I'm good to go. So let's back up another file. How do we do that? I'm going to take, uh, I'll take this one. Okay, so I've selected my file. Now I'm going to go to share and I wanna share this and it lets me choose the file type. I would like to share appropriate because it will keep all the information of the drawing itself that I've done in the Procreate program. I would just need to download Procreate again on a new iPad to set it up, but all the file information will be there. So I'm gonna click Pro Procreate and now it's exporting all this information. Okay, great. So here it is. And we see here that we have saved to files. So I'm gonna click save files and now it will prompt me to go into the different drives that are on my iPad. I'm going to click iPad Pro Backup Disk. And you can see here's the previous Procreate file. It recognizes it in, um, in the window, which is great. I'm just gonna go ahead and save this one there and save is in the upper right corner, save. So I'm gonna close all of this. Now let's make sure that it worked. So files, here it is right here. Let's click it. Now it's importing the duplicate. And there it is, there's my little marmot that I painted. So um, there it is. That is how you back up your files on 
an additional external hard drive. I hope this helped you. It definitely helped me a lot. Have a great day and thanks so much. Bye.